very good. Also, do not know why it's... <sighs> hate this. Come on, it is not... Come on! Boy, okay, finally. Alright, so we're here with Pokemon. Um, we're going to get... We're going to have a special guest join us. In game, but what the? F okay, hold on. Oh my god. We're gonna have a special guest join us in game, but. Come on! Fucking damn it, Streamlabs. I swear to God. Ah! Jesus. That's like the fucking worst. Alright, now let's go. Wait, first of all, I'm not doing any of that. I don't want to party right now. Taking. Vaccine and Moltres sure out those. Okay, cool. First of all, all right, so I think this is it. Yeah, okay, cool. Oh, it doesn't even matter because I can't fucking damn it.
Okay. Yep. Oh, God. I don't know what the heck is up with, like, everything else with Streamlabs. I, I just, I don't know. This happens every a few seconds ago? Come on! Streamlabs, this shit is not that hard. It's really not that hard, Streamlabs. It's just, it just ain't that hard. It just ain't that hard, Streamlabs. It just ain't. Breathe in. I'm not gonna ready up until this says closest in two minutes. Oh god. It's not that hard, Streamlabs. It is not that hard to frickin' It oh god, it just ain't that hard. What? Okay, fine. Make sure and it just connected me from the okay. Okay, stream loves. Okay, so link code. Right, others. Oh my god, okay. Same people, same person. Gonna ready up until Uh, okay. Okay, come on. One sec. Wait. Very good again. Okay. First, 
to make sure I'm connected to the internet. I already have Hobo. Cool. Okay. transition anytime I like swap games or want to open discord the shit just it oh god okay Nice. So we can find at least two others. I, d I kind of don't want to go in without two others. Kind of don't want to do that. That would be bad. Just hi. Okay, fine. We'll just have to carry it. Because that gone. Alright, I don't know. No. Ah, okay. Mm. Let's go with that boy. Oh, come on, really? Come on, RJ. Get, get me, like... Pick up the thank you. The electric is up top, so I need to keep, like, not a water type. Let's go flying. This will work. But will everyone agree is the question. Alright then. Uh, 
let's see, let's go. Yeah, okay. You know, I halfway expected that to be different. I halfway expected to like crash onto the ground for that. But no. Why? type of the top. I gotta figure out what I need. Wait, am I already... Perfect.
Real competitive and effective. Me going through this? Wait a minute, hold on a second. Is it still me going through this? Okay, yeah. I'm connected to the internet, but is this still me? who were doing a raid are not but are doing the same raid. Oh yeah, I'm getting that boy out. that in a Dynamax dungeon it wouldn't be, but it is. Uh, I want to swap. Because I know I'm going to need it. Uh, 
belt. With power of super effective moves, yes. I'm gonna grab that. Come on, kidding. Happy puppy. Yes! Yes! It's Raikou! <laughs> yes! It was me! <laughs> yes! Let's do this! Okay. <laughs> oh god. I'm honestly kind of looking for this puppy. I honestly have. And he is one-shotting the fuck out of all of us. This is bad. We're gonna be kicked out. I could take my own Pokemon. <laughs> Seriously, I wish I could. We're gonna go right back in there and we're gonna go find that puppy. Try this again. Make sure I'm connected to the internet. Okay, cool. Now I'm connected to the internet. Let's do this again. Yes. Yeah. Which Pokemon? I'm going for Raikou again. Because I am one step closer to uh, getting the puppy. Okay, cool. We are going to get this puppy because I want this puppy. And I'll be one step closer to having a legendary puppy team. Oh, I just need to get freaking uh, the other one, the sword puppy, which I would probably need someone to trade with me. Sword puppy. 
I mean shield puppy. Okay. So he's an electric type. Don't growl. What the f No. Why does that keep happening? What the f Okay. Let's try this again. Connect to the internet. It's not that hard. Come on. This isn't that hard. Okay. No, I know I can't. I'm not... Ha! Ah, God, okay. Yes, please. Yes, I know. Try to. Okay, yes. Oh god, I hate this. All right. Oh my God, okay. Hopefully this will work this time and it won't be that bad. Because I have no idea what happened. I honestly have no idea what happened. I really don't want to go uh, with randos, but I probably will end up going with randos. Okay, let's just redo it. Make sure I'm connected to the internet. Cool. Not gonna work out.
Yep, save my adventure. Some code from the others. Okay, let's see who we get this time. Put on order of this game. Is it any good? Oh, it's really good. Uh, Pokemon Sword. You can't go wrong with either Sword or Shield. I just chose Sword because, I mean, I like sports. So, yeah. But, um, this game is good, honestly. Uh, I'd recommend you get the DLC packs as well, which I think you can get both of them uh, for 30 bucks. So all together, I mean, you're spending 90 unless you got it from, like, Mercury or somewhere like that, but, um, yeah, I, I say that this game is good. It's one of the best Pokemon games I've played. It honestly really is. I mean, you can raise with friends, raise with people online. Like, I mean, it's, it's honestly really good. What am I doing here? Okay, what do you mean? Like, on, on the adventure, or just here? Okay, let's do this again. <laughs> On the game? Uh, okay, so in order to get to this point of the game, you have to uh, have both Crown Tundra and Isle of Armor. And in this game, at this point of the game, you have... Um, at this point in the game, what you have is you can essentially go through the um, the Dynamax dungeon, and you're basically going legendary hunting. And this is on the uh, Crown Tundra. But in order to like fully go through this, you have to beat both the Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra DLC story modes first. Um, whatever Pokemon you have. You cannot carry it into the, um, you cannot carry it into the dungeon with you, but this dungeon just serves as a purpose for you to, like, um, get, uh, legendary Pokemon, like, you can catch, like, I'm currently going for, a uh, Raikou to get the other legendary puppies. I think there's, like, one more legendary puppy I can get from this? I'm not sure, but this is basically legendary hunting.
But in the main story of the game, though, you are, um... I can't remember the town that you move into, but you move into this new town, and, um, you're taking part in the Pokemon tournament, um, which is held by the, um, your rival for this game, Pop. You are taking part in the tournament, and, um, which is held by his brother, and it's basically your standard go throughout the Pokemon world, collecting many Pokemon, and in this one, you get to, uh, fight Leon, um, Pop's brother, Leon. And, you know, you become the Pokemon League champion and all that stuff for this game. But, uh, with this one as well, there's a main... I just have the base game. What can I do with friends? Um, if you just have the base game, uh, you can pretty much... If you have the base game, you can battle your friends, trade with your friends, um... All that stuff, like you can battle and trade and go on raids with your friends. It doesn't matter if you have sword or shield. You can um, you can trade, you can trade, battle and raid with your friends on the base game alone. But you won't be able to do any legendary hunting outside of the base outside of the base game's legendary, which is. Um, Zamazenta, if you get Sword, and Zamazeku, I think, if you get Shield. So, you won't be able to do any other Legendary hunting outside of this game's Legendary, but um, you can do everything else uh, in the base game with your friends. The only thing the DLC allows is like you can do Legendary hunting and stuff like that. Okay, ground is not good for electric. What's the raid I haven't played since Game Boy? Oh my, wow, wow, oh boy. Okay, so raid is what I'm doing right now. Okay, so when you raid uh, in this game, generally in the world of Pokemon for Sword and Shield, generally what happens is in the main overworld of this game, you'll you'll see like a cluster of rocks, and they'll they're called they're called dens in this game. And you can and if a beam of energy is coming up from the cluster of rocks that you see, uh, you collect what's known as wattage. Wattage helps you um, trade purchase. Wattage helps you um, buy items from certain uh, NPCs in the game. But also, um, it, it's what powers your fight. And so when you see a beam of energy coming up from the cluster of rocks, it's called a den. When a, when a beam of energy is coming up from the cluster of rocks, you, you go into that dungeon and you can fight that Pokemon. Now, Pokemon have, like, star ratings. Uh, and star ratings will tell, will tell you how strong they are. And... With the star ratings, what ends up happening is um, if it's like one to three, it's normal, easy to normal. Uh, four is medium, five is hard. Um, but if you know you're typing, you're fine. Uh, and with the base game, you can raid with your friends. Each person has a chance to catch the Pokemon that they're going up against in the raid battle. Now, the raid battle does have rules. In the raid battle, if one, like, you see that there's like one, two, three people here? Well, four? Typically, there's like four to five people who go into a raid, and you each take turns battling that one Pokemon that you see. Now, if you, um, now, if, if everybody's Pokemon falls once, there, there's rules to it. If you don't beat the Pokemon within 10 minutes time, you'll be kicked out of the raid. Or if one, if each player's Pokemon falls once, which is so it's four people, so if each Pokemon, if each player's Pokemon faints once, that counts 
as a loss. Four losses and you're kicked out. But you can still challenge the Pokemon as long as that den is active. But raids are a way where you can at least uh, battle Pokemon and such with your friends. That's, that's what raids are. If you have if you have Pokemon Go, it's similar to that, but not as similar. Because in Pokemon Go, you fight one Pokemon, I think. Yeah, you fight one Pokemon, but you can use multiple of your Pokemon. However, in this raid dungeon, you can't bring your own Pokemon. You have to take the Pokemon that they give you. In regular raids, like in the base game, you can take your own Pokemon. So there's an advantage there for you with your own Pokemon. I guess. No! Okay, well, you can. So, like, if you went into a raid by yourself... One second. Okay, so you can. So, um, when you, you're fighting together, but you're each taking turns. So, like, now, like, like, how, how this battle's gonna go. There's four of us in this battle. We're all fighting that one Pokemon right there. So, if we're all fighting that one Pokemon, that means that each of us can only take one turn. And this is me fighting with different people um, around the world. However, if you have, like, okay, so if you want to specifically fight with your friends, you can do, one, there's, there's one, if you want to specifically fight with your friends, there's one of two ways that you can do this. One way that you can do it, if you fight with your friends and you're all connected to the internet, you can search for each other, um... You can search for each other if you're all friends on Switch. But, say you hit 50, does it take away 50 from everyone? Okay, so what do you mean? Like, are you talking about if you hit 50 points, does it take 50 away? But, or, like, what do you mean? Because I, I, I want to understand what you mean by 50 so that I can tell you correctly. So, does the Pokemon have the same HP when it dies? It dies for everyone? Uh, yes and no. Okay. So, think of it like this, right? So each, so think of it like this, think of it like live, right? So you know how, well no, 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 think about it like Pokemon, right? So whenever you, whenever you go into a, a fight in general in Pokemon, you have five Pokemon that you can choose from, right? So if you have five Pokemon that you can choose from, each of those Pokemon count as one, as one life that you have in the in the entire battle. So that means that if one Pokemon fades, you have one less Pokemon that you can use. Right? So in raid battles, instead of you carrying four Pokemon, the next person carrying four Pokemon, and so on and so on, you can only bring one Pokemon into the battle. 
And if you bring one Pokemon into the battle, and one other person brings, and three other people bring their one Pokemon into the battle, you in total have four Pokemon in the battle at once to battle that one Pokemon. So that means that if one Pokemon faints, you can't, that counts as a strike against your entire team. So that means that if that Pokemon, so that means if that Pokemon goes down, you, you will in turn, okay, so it was really I forgot to mention. So, you see that storm cloud that's above the Pokemon's head? That, that storm cloud that's above Ra Raikou's head. <clears throat> if... If four Pokemon faint, the storm that you're in will increase to the point to where you can't stand it and it'll kick you out of the gym. So, this also means that you, you're not only just playing for yourself in these raid battles, you're also playing for, wow, like that. You're also playing for um, everyone else. So like right now, if my Pokemon were to fall, that's one Pokemon that's out for the time being until it's revived. And if one Pokemon's out, the storm gets stronger. Two Pokemon, it gets stronger. Three, the same. Four is strong enough so we can't stand it. That's the thing about these raids is it's not just you, it's everybody. So see, like, my Pokemon just fainted, right? That means the storm is going to get bigger. But we're not in danger yet. If another Pokemon faints, that means that the storm will get bigger. But since we're about to beat this one Pokemon, everybody has a chance to catch that same Pokemon. So see, like, now, Raikou's weak enough, right? So that means all I have to do is do this. And now I have the Pokemon. And that's essentially like winning the raid. So what? Yes, I'm taking Riku with me. Came here for the puppy. It's essentially how this, this game works. Uh, nah. Hmm. And I can't do anything with it yet, so... Send it to a box. I'll, I'll put it in my party in a second. Raikou? That wasn't about when I was... Oh! God, yeah, Raikou's really rare. Raikou came in, like, the third or fourth generation? Okay, hold on. Let me ask you a question. The last time you played Pokemon, was it, like, yellow, red, or blue? Because Raikou's kind of really rare. <laughs> because Raikou wasn't in uh, Yellow, Red, or Blue, or Platinum, or 
silver, I don't think. Red, silver, two, but I don't remember. Okay, cool. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, my buddy Riku, Riku is like really rare. I have two of the three legendary puppies. Hold on one sec. in this game? Yes, I think, I think, yes, I know in Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, <coughs> which is essentially Pokemon Yellow, I know Mewtwo is in that. I know that's the case. I, I've, I've seen Mew, but I'm not entirely sure if Mew 2 is in this. I'd have to check. I think so? But I'm not sure, so don't hold me to it. Hello, thanks so much for the follow. Thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you so much. Actually, nah, I'll quit. We'll do another raid another time. Alright, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna head over to the. Uh, where are we going? Let's go to my boxes first. Alright, so I'll show you all the legendaries I currently have. Oh, Moltres is on this. So, like, <coughs> so like you see, uh, Suicune. Suicune's here. Zaxian, he's the legendary for this game. Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno. I think those are first or second gen. Oh, and Holo's here too, so... Yeah, Moltres, Zapdos, and then they're here. Uh, Holo's here. Arcerian's here. Registeel, Regice, and Regirock are here. And I have Regi, um, Regidrago. Regidrago is, is a Regi that you can get in this game. Oh, and as far as the other red legendary... Uh, Clerix is here as, as well, so, yes. I think ho is a first-gen legendary. I could be wrong. <clears throat> I know that, yeah, Mr. Ryan's here. Uh, 
Pikachu's here, but that's not a legendary. I had another legendary. Oh, yeah. Luna Law? First me, like... Uh, fix my party. Oh, and Charizard's here. <laughs> I don't, I'm not sure if you count as, like, a legendary or not. Not sure. So, um, let's... Fix this. Uh... Okay, so, buddy. Oh, that's, uh, the Gigantamax one. I'm calling Popo. Okay, so let's fix this. Let's... Raikou, you're gonna be ahead of. Well, you're basically gonna replace Zappy Bird over here. Articuno, you will stay there. Well, let me move you up for a sec. Okay, cool. So, these are all the puppies that I have right now. I'm gonna keep Moltres. Keep Cinderace. Well, no, I might get rid of Moltres. Because I already have Cinderace. So watch this is here. I'm gonna put you, buddy, Rayquaza, in my party. And you're gonna sit there. Charizard? Oh, Charizard's a first gen Pokemon. I'm sure Charizard's first gen. Uh, and also, I need to beef up the puppies. Uh, I typed after I saw it because, <laughs> nah, it's all good. I, I feel that. I understand. <laughs> I, I get it. I promise. I get it. Uh, let's see. Do I have any candy so I can pump into these puppies? Uh, because I need to pump up the water puppy. Um, uh, come on. Give me candies. Also, I want to tell you this, too. You're going to want a lot of these. The, um, experience candies, you're going to want a lot of those. Uh, the, the, the way that you can get <clears throat> experience candies in this game, the way you get them is you go to raids in the main, um, in the main area. So I'll show you what, what I mean by, uh, raids. So let's, I'll show you what I mean by like raids and such. So let's go pick, uh, area. Alright, so here's an area. Yeah, and in this game, Charizard can Gigantamax. After you beat Leon, you can get his, Char his Charmander and raise it to a Charizard. That can Gigantamax. <coughs> and Dynamax and Gigantamax are basically like turning Pokemon into giant kaiju fights. So, like, here is a den, right? Here is a Pokemon den. And in this den, generally what you'll see are like, it'll glow like this light red color. And so, what happens is. There'll be energy coming out of this den. And when energy is coming out of this den, you can click on this den and you can go do a raid. That's essentially how you raid with your friends. The way you can tell how strong the Pokemon is is by the is by the color of energy. So in this game. So in this game, what happens... So in this game, what happens is when you approach a den like the one I was just at, if you approach that den and there's uh, energy coming from it, like a pink light coming from it, it could be anywhere from one to four star of type of Pokemon. Now, if there's pink energy coming from it and there's like a dark grayish swirl from around it, that means that the Pokemon is either really strong or it can be rare. And when you beat that Pokemon, what ends up happening is, is you get, um, 
rare candies. Rare candies is a really quick way to level up your Pokemon. It, it helps out a lot. It doesn't, the rare candies don't have a Pokemon a type that, that go with it. You can just put it into whatever Pokemon you want to put it into. Along with like battling systems, along with battling the standard way, you can just put it into your um, your your um, your Pokemon that you want to beef up. Now, this has a sheer rating system, and since you haven't played any other Pokemon games since like Red, um, the sheer battle system was implemented in like the third or fourth gen, I think. I know it was from Pokemon uh, Ruby. So in Pokemon Ruby, in your party, you had the option to do share experience, which meant that Pokemon in your party, if you battled with your main Pokemon, I think the second Pokemon that you have underneath your starter can also gain experience as well. So now what they did was in Pokemon Let's Go, what they did was they had it where you could, um, they had it where, um, if you battle with one Pokemon, every Pokemon in your party gains experience as well. And that's the same way it works with this game. In this game, when you battle with your Pokemon, every Pokemon in your party, every Pokemon that you have your top five, every one of those gains a bit of experience as well. That experience, is, that experience can vary depending on the person or how strong the Pokemon is. The only time, I think, the only time that the shared Pokemon rating, um, the shared Pokemon experience thing doesn't work is when you're in a um, raid den. That's the only time it doesn't work. But when you battle with other Pokemon outside of a raid den and you battle in the game, and in other parts of the game, it works. Now, I could be wrong about the raid den thing, but so far, to my knowledge that I've seen, it only works if you're not in a raid den. And it's, yeah, it only works if you're not in a raid den. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Listen, if you want to join my Discord, you can. Just click that link and it'll take you to my Discord. But we are going to get ready to raid. And I'm going to get out of here. Um, and so, again, thank you guys so much for coming in. Thank you so much for following. Um, Arlon Flammable? Please, please be sure to come back because, honestly, I'd love to challenge you sometime. I'd love to battle with you and friends sometime. So please, please be sure to come back. Um, I typically stream Monday through Saturday, 1 to 4 Central Standard. So please be sure to do that. Let's see. Who are we going to raid? Oh, you got to be kidding me. All right, hold on. Let's let's see. Nice, thanks. Um, let's see. Uh, I want Apex. Zombifies. What's an Apex? Let's see, let's go and raid. Ah, that's person playing Animal Crossing, alright. 
So let's go and um, raid. Um, bless us. Let's go raid her. She's playing some Animal Crossing. No problem. Um, anytime. Anytime, anytime at all. Anytime. Um, <clears throat> just let me know. And when you are better at the game and you, um, and you feel like you want to take on a challenger, I'll be happy to raid you. That'll be no problem at all. So we are going to go raid Balthesis, I think that's her name. I'm gonna go raid her. She's playing some Animal Crossing. So thank you guys so much. Love each and every one of you. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow. And until next time, guys, go catch them all. Love you, and I'll see you next time. All right, everybody. Peace.